Coffee here, back with another mukbang. What I have for you today is a Caesar salad kit from Aldi's that I got, and I added some rotisserie chicken. Do I got a story for you? And um, some croutons. These are Aldi croutons, but they're not from the salad kit, because in the salad kit, all it was was freaking powder. I don't know what happened to the salad kit. And then, I know it's not typical, at least I've never seen it. Let me know if I'm wrong. I added boiled eggs. Because, number one, I like boiled eggs. And for two, it's my salad. I do what I want. Okay? <laughs> I did a close-up, and I'll put it in right here. It's a salad for love. Yeah, but salads can look good, right? What I have for you to drink is um, the one another AHA, but this is the kind that I like. I was uh, at the convenience store, I think Thursday, and they had a special two for like three bucks. And so I got the lime watermelon. And I was going to cut up some limes in here, but I got tired of it. <laughs> so, but this is a really good flavor. I bet you the extra lime would taste super, super good. I was done mixing it of several minutes ago, so it's starting to wilt, so I need to get on it. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Now, has your body ever, like, craved, like, fresh stuff? Fresh stuff? Mmm. Really, really good. Can I, can I get this dry ass? <laughs> I always think, that I'm recording on my camera, finally. Y'all. Yeah. I, uh, remember I lost the SD card. I mean, I got a different one for something else because I lost the one from the camera. So, I, um, put that one in there and I recorded a little bit and it did fine. So I said, okay, so it's plugged in charging. I don't, I don't trust the battery. I don't know which one's in here. So then... I am um, trying to put it back in and it wouldn't go in. So I tried and tried and tried and uh, someone, you know, I was talking to someone and they suggested to do this and this and this and I did, but I finally said, you know what? And I just shoved it in there. So it says it's recording and everything. So let's hope I don't lose this footage. Okay. I'm about to, this story is about someone else. So I'm about to text them my Told them I was going to tell it. But I'm going to see if they want to call and interject. Probably not. I don't even know if they're busy. So, you know... Trying to meal prep, trying to get stuff that's quick and easy but healthy because you know when the kid's away, I can eat like crap. So, the best thing is, is to get rotisserie chickens. That's what's in here. Chicken, as you saw in the close-up. So, I have been trying to stop and go get, to go get some because I don't know if you know... You cannot, for a Walmart pickup or delivery, you cannot put stuff like that. Anything prepared like that cannot go on the list. Well, I couldn't get any. So, okay, no answer, so we'll keep going. I'll just tell it. 
That light is my phone. So, I go to do a Walmart pickup, and it's uh, the neighborhood market one. So, um, it's not quite 2 o'clock, and I haven't got the email or the text, because I have both notifications, that my pickup's ready. So, I'm sitting in the parking lot waiting to go around, ready for the email. And um, I was like, well, you know, I'll go in and try to get some more sweet chicken. So I go in and I happened to be on the phone with none other than Smash Mama. So we're talking, hey, what's up? You know, typical friend stuff. And I tell her what I'm doing. So we're chit-chatting and I go to the back. I don't, I don't you know, Yelp, Walmart, you know, they have the hot thing used by the registers and that's where they keep the chickens. Didn't see it. Don't even know if the neighborhood, I don't even know if the neighborhood market carries that. So I go back to the deli where they make them. And, um... You know, I'm talking out loud, I'm talking to her, and I say, oh man, they're out. I can't believe it, that whole case is empty. There's no fried chicken, there's no rotisserie chickens. So, I'm like, golly. And so, Smash is like, well, maybe you could ask, is there somebody working back there? Maybe you can ask to see if, you know, if they have some. So, I thought, okay. Okay, well, I'll stop here, and she says I can call her, so hang on, y'all. She said, call me, she's not picking up. And I told you I was going to tell the, the, the chicken lady story. And I've got, I've got, you want to say hi to everyone? Hello, my beautiful people. I've taken over the channel. This is no longer for this channel. <laughs> <laughs> so I've gotten up to the point where I go in and I tell you that um, there's no chicken or anything. And you suggest that I talk to someone. And I thought that was a good idea. So this is as far as we've gotten with this story. Okay, y'all. Okay. So, I go around and I see one worker and I start asking her about the chicken and she kind of looks at me confused and so she starts coming around the case. So, I tell Smash Mama, I said, oh, I don't think she speaks very much English. It looks like she's not understanding what I'm saying. So, Smash Mama being Smash Mama says, well, put it on speaker and I'll ask her. So, I said, okay. So, I hand the lady the phone. She's looking at me confused. So I hand her the phone. She's on speaker. Well, she puts it up to her ear because I don't think she realizes that she's on speaker. And so she says hello. And then uh, Ash Mama starts talking to her in Spanish. So I, I basically know what they're saying because she's asking about the chicken. And I hear pollo. So I know. I don't know what Spanish, but I know pollo means chicken for sure. <laughs> So they start going back and forth, and the lady starts talking to her and stuff, and I can tell, by the way, that Smash Mama's answering that there is none. So, but then, <laughs> she knows what's coming. Then the lady, the lady was looking at me the whole time, right? And so all of a sudden, uh, Smash Mama keeps talking. 
and I could tell that her voice has changed a little bit and the lady starts not being able to look me in the eye. <laughs> she'd look to the floor and then she'd look up at me and then she'd look right back down. And I'm thinking to myself, okay, I don't, cause I don't know any Spanish. And I'm thinking to myself, what is this heifer saying to this woman? <laughs> I was like, oh my God, and I'm thinking, Smash, you're supposed to be helping me, not helping yourself. <laughs> so, Smash Mama, what do you have to say for yourself? I was just asking for some chicken. I don't know what happened. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> well, she, she sounded really sweet. And we got into some something of a conversation, and and me being myself, you guys, anyone who watches my channel, you know I'm I'm a I'm a little hoochie mama. So <laughs> me being myself, <laughs> I, you know I, I started to sweet talk her because I figured I could pry some secret chicken somewhere from the back for you. <laughs> oh, that was all yeah. for me, huh? Yeah, the fact that she wouldn't give you back the phone and she kept blushing, I, I, that was a totally different ballgame. Yeah. I don't know why that happened. Yes, y'all. I could tell that the conversation was starting to finish up, right? You, you could tell. Evolve. Yeah. Evolve, actually. <laughs> so, um, I don't know what Smash is saying, but I guess she's kind of pretty much wrapping it up. And the lady starts handing me the phone, but she would grin and start blushing, and then she would like, Bring the phone back to her ear. I'm still not realizing it was on speaker. I'm like, oh my god, she ain't giving me my phone back. <laughs> she she just told me all her business. <laughs> she told me she told me all of the Walmart passwords and everything. She just told me all this. <laughs> she, was, she was a sweet lady, and 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 I think if you go back, you might get some free chicken. I probably will. All I have to do is hand her the phone. I'll just give her to you, and you just give me everything. It's, it's that Puerto Rican charm. <laughs> <laughs> it, it must it must be, but I did. I was like, I'm watching this lady, and she's looking at me, and then all of a sudden, she starts looking down and doesn't want to look me in the eye, and I'm like, oh, I thought, what is Smash telling this woman? Little heifer? Uh, she, am I the little heifer? She yes! <laughs> I'm thinking this little heifer's supposed to be helping me, and she's helping herself. I was just trying to get you some chicken. I appreciate it, Smash Mama. I, I mean, if I was going to get a little drum, drum uh, stick myself, that's on me. Sharing is caring, fluff. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll share my chicken lady with you, Smash. No, you can have the chicken. I just want the chicken lady. Can that's what I said. You can have the, you can, I'll share my chicken lady with you. And in true YouTube fashion, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and comment. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for stopping Take by. Care. Take care, love. Well, Enjoy your meal. I will. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye, everyone. I'm just thanking her for stopping by, y'all. So, that's the funny, funny story. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> she did not. But, there was, there was, um. <laughs> yeah, that lady was funny. She, she sure did get a kick out of Smash Mama. Oh, Smash Mama really was trying to help me out. Right, no chicken. I think the lady told her that. It was like her, own, her, we forgot to mention it was only her first day, it was her first day. She didn't know a lot about what she was doing and she had something else in the ovens. So she would have to wait until that got done, then she'd have to put the chickens in there and then I'd have to wait again until she got done. I couldn't wait, I couldn't stand for that long. But, yeah, I was... Tickled by the little flirtation going on. <laughs> well, that was such a funny story. I didn't eat while we were telling it. <laughs> yeah, but we're
rotisserie chickens are good. You know, I told you, uh, Smash Mom has been trying to help me with, like, prepping and stuff, and it's really been helping. And one of the things she said, which I, I did do, is, I've done before, but I agreed with her, is rotisserie chickens are so good to have. I don't know how this will focus, but you saw closer. So, because I just, you know, chopped this up and put it on top or just kind of mixed it in. Cooking eggs ahead of time. Things like that. It's really come in handy. So, and then you do things like this where, look, y'all can tell I have drumstick meat in here. I love dark meat. I mean, I like chicken breast, but you have to be careful because... No, my hair is looking like a busted can of biscuit. I'm looking lopsided. So I got my blue glasses, and I hate them. <laughs> oh, no, I liked them when I tried them on that day. I, I I was looking for more of a round ones, but I do have a hard copy of my um prescription. And the, the frames themselves were pretty cheap, but my prescription is what was expensive. And... I asked for no glare, and she kept saying they were no glare, so we'll see how this video, because I didn't dim any any of the, the camera lighting or anything, so, and I can see, excuse me, I can see my eyes, so hopefully the, I had to buy a package, and the package was really expensive, just $100 of that was just the frame, it was, um, they were on sale. My daughter helped me pick them out, we'll be honest, because I... I've been cleaning today, trying to trying to keep the house picked up. I think I've been doing a pretty good job. You know, as much dog hair as I find of big dogs, uh, she should be naked now. She just should. <laughs> All her fur should be gone. So, let's mm. not talk. I love the chicken. My chicken tastes good in here. Salad is really good. It's a chopped salad. Like, the lettuce is like more shredded than pieces. I like that. I love croutons. I like croutons so much that I like them as a snack, like chips. <laughs> I have done it. How many have done that? Oh, I love it. Sorry about the scraping, y'all. I know some of y'all don't mind it and some of y'all hate it, so I'm sorry. I'm trying not to. It's hard getting back in the swing of things. I've been gone a while, huh? I'm sorry. <laughs>
Those of y'all that are subscribed to me are probably subscribed to Smash Mama. But if not, I'll put a link up here, a little eye in the sky, to her channel. I'll let her know I sent you. Can you can you chew it with them teeth, Molly? Come here, Molly. Up, Molly. Up. Come on, they want to see you too. There's Molly. Sheba. Come here, Sheba. Let's see if we can get her. Come on, Sheba. Come here. There she is. <laughs> I, I just got a crouton, y'all. Nothing serious. Well, boo boo. You really got no, well. No, you know what happens when you have too much dry stuff. <laughs> minutes? What? <laughs> that was hard to get used to these glasses because, well, I'm not four eyes anymore. You've got bifocal here. I'm, yeah, and the, fo the phone. The camera just moved because no man just knocked into it. I guess he thought he was going to find something on the floor, which normally he does, but I'm trying to be careful. <laughs> well, I see a line. It's gotten a little bit better, but salad. It just really tastes good with it. My favorite all-time salad is an old-fashioned chef salad. Mm -hmm. Ham and turkey. And I'm eating the eggs went to a Italian restaurant in Austin. Mm, bigger than Austin. I'm going to try to do it tomorrow, maybe sometime next week. I, I realize there's a Trader Joe's close to me. I didn't even know I had one in Austin. There's apparently three of them. If I go, I will vlog it. It's just a matter of, will I go? I don't know how crowded it gets and, you know, with certain things going on right now. <laughs> Look, this salad's so good, I'm hardly drinking. What was I saying? Chef Dal Oh! Come back, left. <laughs> For a while, me and the ex were on this. Let's try different restaurants when we're in another town or whatever. And try them out. So we went to this Italian restaurant and they had this wedge salad. I don't think I'd ever had a wedge salad before. I heard of them, but I never had one. Y'all, they have this kind of a... I think it was a homemade ranch. But it has the mildest blue cheese uh, crumbles on there because I can't stand blue cheese. I just really can't. Of course, I can't say that now because I like that particular blue cheese. And it had, like, some kind of candied almonds on it, drizzled on it, some purple onion. Oh, my God. It was, like, the best salad ever. I'm like, I don't want lunch. You need to give me two wedges. <laughs> It was really good, but my my favorite is um, is just a good old fashioned chef salad. What about y'all? Comment your favorite salad below. I'm curious. I've never seen it. Well, they probably smell the chicken. <coughs> I've seen those dogs wanting some salad board by life. Oh, don't sneeze. You've been doing good all day today, Fluff. Don't start now because you're recording. <laughs> Alright. I'm going to 
use this last egg because as the salad dwindles down because I'm using real silverware, it's just going to scrape and scrape and scrape and I think that's just really going to get people in the teeth, you know? So I'm going to eat this egg and then I'm going to bounce. 26 minutes, not too bad. Look, I'm trying to get stuffed up because I want to sneeze. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Delicious. Thank you all for joining me for lunch today. It is 2 o'clock Texas time. As soon as I shut this off, I will edit and get it up and keep rolling. I'll clean the house slowly but surely. Smash Mama, thanks for swinging by and talking about the chicken lady. <laughs> God bless y'all. Positive vibes up to each and every one of you. Remember to always be kind and be your own advocate. I love y'all and I will talk to y'all real soon. Okay? Bye!